Hello YouTube and welcome back to another Dare to Game video. Today we're playing Saints Row and I'm going to be showing you how to get this unique item. It's called the Kiss Cactus Hat. It's actually a helmet, not a hat, but it makes sense considering that it is a cactus wearing a hat. Uh, how it got that name. Pretty unique looking. Obviously it gives you the appearance of having the head of a cactus wearing a cowboy hat. So uh, pretty fun, whimsical Saints Row type nonsense. Uh, but yeah, so just for a closer look at it right there, you can see that uh, it's in the helmet section of your hats once you've gotten it. And uh, it can be upgraded, I guess, or I should say customized color-wise, you know, so you can make it look however you want, like most things in this game. I think it's uh, a decently funny item, and it is very unique, so if you want to collect it, I can show you how to do that in this video. So this hat is a unique reward that can only be obtained in one way, as far as I know, and it's by completing two historical sites. So now I'm just going to show you uh, where both those sites are and how to, like, where all the panels are in them, and just, I'll show you the process of getting it. So let's just jump into that now. Welcome to the Grand Prix by Louis Welch Mullane. To learn more about the history of street art in Santo Aleso, visit Beware the Grizzly Bear in Old Town. Listen to every panel at both sites to win a prize. I feel like I forgot something. Did you know? The Grand Prix is a celebration of innovation, ingenuity, and industry. These spidery speedsters race to see who will be the first to reach the big juicy orange at the top of the tower. That got me angry. Did you know? Keep it strange, Santo is the official slogan of the Cavanaugh County Independent Business Alliance. And no local artist has done more to keep it strange than sculptor Louis Welch Mullane. I think I believe in hate at first sight. <laughs> Did you know? The artist scavenged parts to build these racers from the Scorpion Auto Plant in Smelterville. The factory closed its doors in 1970 when it could no longer compete with more modern facilities. Yeah, sure, sure. Good luck with that. Boring. Did you know? The Grand Prix is a street art installation by local sculptor Louis Welch Mullane. More of the artist's work can be viewed at his studio and gallery in the Rojas Desert. Hell yeah! Congratulations, you have completed the Grand Prix. All right. Welcome to Beware the Grizzly Bear by Nazoni Fisher. To learn more about the history of street art in Santo Aleso, visit the Grand Prix in Rancho Providencia. Listen to every panel on both sites to win a prize. So much for the wagon. Did you know? This exhibit of local artist Nazoni Fisher is brought to you by the Cavanaugh County Independent Business Alliance, who remind you to keep it strange, Santo. Did you know? In this work, the waste products of late capitalist society are assembled into a hungry predator. With its bloody fangs and sharp claws, the bear is poised to rip the viewer to shreds. Sorry, uh, I wasn't paying attention. Did you know? The 
is Oni Fisher is now considered one of the most provocative and innovative artists of her generation. Her work is celebrated by creators, critics, and collectors from around the world. Nice talk. Did you know? Fisher remained anonymous throughout her career. She installed her work under the cover of darkness to the surprise and occasional horror of the local neighborhood. You are not gonna make me wait. I'm gonna tell my wife I was at work. Congratulations, you have completed Beware the Grizzly Bear. Nina would be proud of me. Thank you for exploring hidden history with the Cavanaugh County Park Service. Keep it strange, Santo. You know I always do. Do the idols just complain all the time? And so that'll do it. So once you've gone to both those spots and gone through all of the panels and everything, I mean, you don't really need to listen to them, but I find them amusing enough, uh, then you'll have this hat. So that is the reward for doing those. I uh, hope you enjoyed this video. hope you found it useful. Uh, if you are interested in collecting obscure things in this game, uh, stick around. I'll have a playlist linked to the description where basically all of this type of content that I'll be making for this game will be. So with all that in mind, thanks a ton for watching and have a nice day, and we'll see you next time. Thanks for watching another Dare to Game video. If you like this video, please leave a like and a comment. If you haven't already, be sure to subscribe to the channel. If you like my content and would like to support this channel, consider becoming a member today for as little as $1.99 a month. It makes a huge difference. But in any case, thanks for watching and have a nice day. I'll see you next time.